Okay, we're going to make some comparisons here of different hoses and hard pipes to see how fast they actually pull down and how they effectively hold the pull down. You may be surprised at what we find. Okay, we're going to start this thing and I'll use a little timer here. And this is hard pipe. There's a valve in it, but there's uh, but that's all hard pipe up to. And let's see how long this thing takes to uh, come down to uh, vacuum. Okay, we're below a hundred, and that's at about thirty-five seconds. So it's coming down pretty fast uh, with the hard pipe. And you know, mid and three quarter, uh, pretty quick, pretty quick. Pulled it down pretty quick. Uh, and, uh, two minutes, a little better than two minutes. We are down to 81 on the vacuum. And it ends up usually about 60 some microns. So, uh, probably hard pipe's the best way to do that. Uh, most people are not going to use hard pipe, and it is kind of hard to use in the field, so I don't know that you're actually going to do this. Okay, we're going to compare the amount of time it took to pull a vacuum on the uh, piece of hard pipe. Now we're just going to put, this is a brand new hose here. Uh, up to the micron gauge and we'll see how long it takes to pull a vacuum on a flexible hose. You see we're down to 500 microns and that's 35 seconds. Doesn't look like we're moving very fast here now. Uh, seems to be slowly moving down. We probably will never reach the vacuum we reached by uh, using that piece of uh, hard copper pipe. I'm going to let this time out for a while and we'll see how far down we get. Okay, just to show this, we're at over nine minutes now and slowly dropping down. Okay, to give you an idea, we're almost 19 minutes now. And what we end up with is about 164 microns. So I don't think it's ever going to pull down as much as that hard pipe did. There is permeability in, these, uh, in this tubing. There's, there's no two ways about it. It's not... Uh, it's not as tight as a metal pipe would be. So the conclusion is uh, hard pipe is going to uh, hold the best vacuum. Of course, it's obviously not practical, and you're going to have to have flex pipe in there somewhere. So understand the limitations of the flex pipe and, uh, and work with it. Understand you will have some uh, loss through the pipe.